Hi everybody, Cynthia here. Hope you are all enjoying your holiday weekend, Labor Day weekend. Um, I'm back to share my personal Cricut challenge number 93. We were to upcycle a box, a cereal box, cracker box, um, anything like that. Use it, recycle it, and make it into a gift tote. I This is not my idea. I saw this idea on Pinterest. I really loved it. I thought, why throw a box out when you can just you reuse it for something else? So when I store, uh, we don't eat these anymore. I've had this forever. But when I store my boxes, I flatten them all, okay? And I know that I'm going to have to put this back together. But I think I'm going to cut this top part off first. And then I'm going to close it back up. I'm going to hot glue it in here and then close it back up and then make it, cover it with paper and make it into my gift tote. But I wanted you guys to see what the before looked like before I got it started. And I will definitely be back to share with you the final project. We could do any theme we want and we just need one personal, I mean one Cricut image. So I think I'm gonna use my happy birthday paper and make it into a birthday gift tote. So I'll be back to share with you the final project. Hey everybody, I'm back with my number 93 um, personal Cricut challenge and that was to alter the box into a gift tote. I used some of the Recollections buttons. It's like a little party hat. Really cute. The Cricut cartridge I used is the Cricut Alphabet and I turn to page 66 and I used the font shadow party at two and three quarter inches and then font one the word party over it sentiment and then the paper stack I used is the birthday wishes stack by DCWV I had gotten this on clearance quite a while ago um, at Joann's, but I'll just page through so you guys can see the different papers. This one's cute. I love that. So I may be making an album or some layouts out of this one. It's really sweet. I love the balloon paper. There's candles. This is neat because you've got all these cut aparts that you can use. That's to celebrate. Okay, and those I just shoved back in. There's some party hats. And these are different banners you can cut out. I mean borders. Sorry. <laughs> so that's the stack. And this is how my little gift box turned out. So um, in the previous video I told you I was going to cut the tops off. I glued the bottom together with hot glue and sealed it and then I just covered it with paper and then I punched holes in the box and tied knots on the inside of the ribbon pulled it through as the handle and I put some tissue paper in here for now and then there's ribbon and a handle here and then right here is the Cricut image I used and I popped that up on um, foam and then here's the recollections button. And there's a little cute ice cream sundae image and it says ice cream party. So that's it guys. That's how my box turned out. My gift tote. If you guys have any questions let me know. And I will be back with my personal Cricut Challenge calendar page probably sometime tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching. Take care.